welcome back to my channel. So this is part two of my mixed media piece. Part one, if you didn't see it, was where I made the silver butterflies with UV resin that will be encased in this 3D mixed media piece when it's finished. But if you want to see the first part, I will put the link in the description below, or you could just go to my main page of my YouTube channel and find it there. But anyway, this will be um, a lot of painting layers and uh, laying the butterflies and then another layer of resin and then more painting and another butterfly. You get the idea. But in the end, it should look really pretty, sparkly, and 3D. And uh, hopefully you will like it as much as I do. So this is a painting that I am doing with just black and white and two other colors. Dioxazine purple is the star because I am using that with white, making all kinds of shades with it and also with black. And then I also have purple flash, which I am using really to, to give that sparkle and highlight of the pinkish purplish blue color that it gives off, which is really lovely. So as always, I will be using J Diction UV resin and J Diction Long Curing Epoxy Resin. J Diction has all kinds of products, all kinds of resins and mica powders and, and other supplies. So if you want to check out their website, I have a link down below in my description. And if you go in through that using my code and you choose to buy something, you'll get 10% off. So if you're thinking of uh, checking out J Diction, take advantage of that coupon. It's certainly worth it. And uh, also in my product description below, you will also find all the details of the colors I use, the paints, um, where I got things, if I know where I got them. Because some things I use I've had for eons. And I'm sure if you're a uh, an artist, you know what I'm talking about. You don't even know where it came from. But uh, check down there, and there's also my email address, how to contact me, my social media, my Amazon wish list. And thank you, everyone, that has used that wish list and sent me things. I really, really appreciate that support. And thank you, all my subscribers that continue to make comments or give me a thumbs up. All of that means so much to me and really helps with the YouTube algorithm and keeping me in rotation. Now, if you happen to like what you see and you haven't subscribed, I hope that you will before this video is done. And then click the bell for future notifications so you'll know every time I post something. So now let me tell you guys, um, things are really getting down to the wire. My daughter's getting married next week. And very exciting. And uh, we're flying out to where she is. So I am going to be gone for a few weeks because besides the wedding, it's visiting and vacation with family, which is wonderful. So uh, then I will be back mid-June with more videos. But uh, until then, I hope you will stay tuned and check out some of my other videos if you haven't seen them as yet. So now I'm just going to be quiet. I'll let you watch the rest of this video and I will be back at the end.
Well, as you see, I'm on the last layer and I'm making sure to coat the entire uh, cradle board surface, top and sides, because then it'll put a nice shiny seal on the entire thing and it'll be finished. So I hope that you enjoyed watching this. I hope maybe if you are an artist working with resin, it might give you some ideas of things you can do. And uh, as always, thank you so much for sticking with me and watching my videos and uh, just being such loyal supporters. It truly means a lot to me. I'm going to miss you guys for the next few weeks. But I will be back and we'll do some more fun things when I get there. So here's the finished piece. It's very 3D and even more sparkly than it looks. I hope you like it. And until next time, everyone, please stay safe, be kind, and have a great day.